Unidos e a França. Obrigado. Uh, right now, it's a good time for good results uh, because uh, you look around and uh, we gain a lot of confidence by by uh, playing uh, against England and Germany. Uh, and today we we uh, came across a very different team, and that is also good to have a lot of possession, possession and at the same time score four goals. Uh, we need a little bit more time, uh, I think, and deal with jet lag, and then we uh, when over in Australia, I think we are as ready as we can be. Uh, and I've said previously that like, uh, we are ranked number eight in the world. It's good to remember that. But I think any team of the 10 best teams could win the World Cup if, if we are healthy and a little bit of luck. Uh, and anything could happen in the World Cup, uh, specifically this World Cup, because it's unique with 32 teams and so on. So, uh, you know, nobody's going to take away our dreams. So let's dream on. <laughs> I think that uh, it was a, a good game for all of us. Uh, I think uh, we, not, we used our heads today, both outside and inside. And I think this was a good send-off game for us. Uh, when it comes to preparation, it feels like uh, <clears throat> we are still not on, in the same page. Uh, but we are getting there and I'm really happy with the preparation right now. I think it's important nowadays to uh, to come to big stadiums. Uh, you have a nice view, and the the crowd was loud today, and especially when uh, Duda scored the goal. Uh, and uh, of course, that that means so much for all of us. And it also tells uh, me that um, all over the world, uh, the women's football is just taking off. Uh, uh, a good attitude, but also um, they embrace the, the women's game. And this World Cup will be something special. Uh, I would say that uh, each lineup is unique. And of course, there are um, uh, players that, uh, in order to be connected, they need to play together a lot. So if you look at the back four, for instance, I think they, uh, they have been playing a couple of minutes before and then continue. So that gives us a little bit of a, uh, a core uh, team, so to speak. Uh, and then we had players, uh, they ended the season late in, in May. That means I, we gave them a lot of minutes. Uh, and what the beauty of that is they got a chance to be in the starting lineup. And at the same time, we can actually look at the bench, and there you had uh, Caroline, Marta, uh, Ari, Debinia. And um, uh, that is a good uh, feeling because we do have a good team. Uh, and uh, those players, they're not even in the starting lineup, but they play a very important part in this team. So that's the whole idea with Juntas, that to, you know, change the, the game and coming off the bench, so to speak. Um, so I'm, I'm happy with uh, the starting lineup, also with the changes we made. 